guys welcome back again it's makes from the next question in today's video i want to to respond to someone who asked a question and it's all about the driving what you call the driving license i know most of you you have driving licenses from your country but remember when you come to this country you must have possessed what we call a gcc driving license for people who have worked in dubai for people who have worked in saudi arabia in any of the gulf corporation countries you stand a higher chances to get a, a driving license Yes, you may have a driving license straight away from your home, uh, from your home country, wherever it may be. But you need to get a driving license in this country and it need to be approved uh, such that you are allowed to drive. That is by issuing you what you call a driving license. And for you to have a driving license here in Qatar, definitely you need to go under what you call a driving test. Depending on which kind of uh, category that you are driving. Let's say uh, you are driving a light vehicle or you are driving what you call a heavy vehicle or you are driving a medium or a minibus or bus or depending on which kind of capacity of the passengers that that uh, driving license has to, to accommodate in one way or the other. Even people are uh, driving ambulances or driving um, uh, uh, forklifters, they definitely also need to have what you call approved that are driving licenses that must be issued by the government of Qatar, which you must definitely know as you are looking for a job that you will come in this country, you will have a driving license for yourself. Then someone asks, how can you get a driving license? Definitely for the question that you need to definitely understand, you cannot get this Qatar driving license when you are outside Qatar. You must be in the country, you must take the test in the country, then you must get the driving license in the country. Something that definitely I need to let you know or something that you need to understand. There are people or are different countries that have what you call different categories of allowing to drive. Let's say, for example, international travelers, but it will definitely depend on which kind of country you are coming from. And each country has its own requirements for you to get a driving license. Some people may have what you call, undergo what you call a direct testing, of which they may be, uh, because of their countries, or the countries, the cooperation with Qatar, or the countries offer them that kind of uh, uh, creativity within their minds for them to get that uh, driving license with what you call direct testing and then there are those that need to go under testing for a given month let's say for example two months for you to be tested until you you pass the exams and you find it for you to get a driving license for for it all but you cannot get a test direct and for people who have worked in the gcc before or people who have had uh, driving jobs in the gcc before i think you stand a higher chances uh, a very higher chance for you to get a driving license because it is still within the same corporation and within the same category that you can have the license for yourself now to some extent the licenses for my own information for the information that i can give it to you right now is that i think it costs around uh, from uh, around 4000 4800 to around uh, uh, to around 6000 depending on which kind of test and which kind of driving schools that you driving school that you have to go we have a couple of number of driving schools here in Qatar that you can go to they can take the practice they will take the exams until you are approved and taken and uh, you pass the exams and given a driving class no most of the time i think they, they give to a maximum of two chances uh, the third chance, once you fail, then they cannot issue you have to wait for until a given period of time for you to get a driving license so most uh, most of this for people who have got a driving license uh, directly, like for example, I'll, I'll tell you as personal myself, I got a driving license because I was recommended uh, by the company. That is also another issue that definitely we need to understand that I was recomm uh, recommended by the company uh, that I go for the driving license and all the issue. I didn't take too much tests. I only took two tests. That is for a couple of two weeks. I passed the test and I was given the driving license. So that scenario also appears in any way or the other. So if you are looking for a job as a driver or what you call driving license, definitely all those kind of things are also need to put in consideration and you need to put them into and you should know uh, something that definitely that will apply and you have to forego that in one way or the other. Hope I've tried to share something for you. Uh, thank you so much. See you again in another video.